Hi there. there, welcome to K Reacts, and today we are watching New Girl Season 2, Episode 22. Alright, so it's been very Nick and Jess centered lately, and I feel like we're finally coming up to the moment, you know, because they've been dancing around this for like half the season now. I mean, technically they've been doing this since like the beginning of the show, basically, but um... It's really picked up this season, for sure. Last episode ended in them saying, let's just be friends, but let's just see how that's gonna play out, shall we? Anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and the full length will be on Patreon if you wanna check it out. The link is down below. And I'm just gonna quit talking and let's get into it. <laughs> Love the oh drip. Please take that thing off. You look like a homeless pencil. I will not take it off. <laughs> what kind of pass? Oh my god, it's Cece's wedding. Wait a minute. It's in three weeks. Cece's wedding. Oh, I forgot about weeks. that. Cece didn't. Ew, Nick, what are you doing? What the heck? No, I mean, I want strippers and mechanical bowl and balloons in the shape of ding dongs. And I want to mechanical wear the goes between your. I just need to kidnap your friend so I can get Cece alone. Rough house him a little bit, drop him off in the desert until he don't breathe no more. <laughs> Winston! What? You know, grandmother and auntie, the auntie just couldn't wait to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Hello? Rang, what are you doing here? I, uh, you so <laughs> like this. So you just assume that I won't have a serious partner by then? I know for a fact you won't. Okay, you're not a relationship guy, and hmm. fine. I can cool. do anything I put my mind to. I once figured out to listen to Milano's okay. phone That's number. That's actually just true. Just choosing numbers. If you have a real girlfriend by the time of the wedding, I will happily give you a plus Challenge one. accepted. Not a challenge. Time to make some dreams oh gosh. come true. I, uh, oh gosh. This will be interesting. Oh dear. Well, somehow this is going to go horribly She's wrong. Coming. Is she going to bring the her like relatives? I'll be really fast. Want to see what your friends are like? Oh no, I knew it, I knew it. Well, you know, I decided to go for some. Oh, oh, oh. Winston! Pin the dawn on the shebang! Oh. oh my gosh! <laughs> so awkward. Jess? I haven't seen Shebang's penis. Shut up. What is that? that small? <laughs> Still yeah, that's what I was gonna say. What does that matter? Some people do that. Like you guys have to promise to keep it G-rated tonight. G-rated. Doesn't seem like it's gonna be that kind of night. Try not to explode with a ranch right now. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not really paying attention because I'm like. Does that make this my surprise bachelor party? You oh gosh. Mouth of yours, Romeo, before I fill it with fire. Hey, you gotta ease. Winston. Up. I need a picture of Shivrang's penis. Dead dad pass, new time. Yeah. How are they supposed to do that? Golf pencil in there for reference. It's not gonna happen. Ooh. One picture and you can go. Oh. Give me 20 minutes. Oh my god. 20 minutes. Whoa, whoa, hey. What are you doing, Winston? What is wrong with you? I don't know. Oh, oh gosh. Spoiler alert. Women are liars. Yeah. Yeah. They're supposed Everyone's liars. Right. I know this is awkward because we slept together and I never returned any of your phone calls. So this might come as a shock to you, but Schmidt, I, I feel like it's head. partially <laughs> you though. Be my girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do to her? I, yeah, but Elizabeth doesn't count. She was during my big guy period. <laughs> if Elizabeth doesn't count, then why is it seared into my brain forever? <laughs> why did you how did you know we were here oh, oh i don't know because you're always here probably all right i'm gonna take a photo of my junk i know you're not <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> yes so subtle is this the kind of wife you want to be no no it's not at all okay i didn't even know this party was happening it was a surprise i promise you this is so not me i didn't want any of it and she's gonna get all upset. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, I don't need to take relationship advice from a girl's in the middle of a seventh grade debacle with a boy across the hall. Oh, oh, I'm a single adult oh. and I kissed another single adult. What's gonna happen? Does Nick like me? I better go pick out a party dress. I wear pajama sets! You yeah, bunch my pajamas! You bunch our entire friendship! Not now, Alfredo. Seriously? I was gonna go cry. No. Where you go? Let the man do his job. Aw. 
But first, I have to use the bathroom. See you in a minute. Oh no, they're gonna go you think what stuck I'm him. Oh my gosh. We orphans, man. And it would mean the world to us. No, don't say it. If uh, we can get a photo of your penis. Oh my gosh, she said it. Cece? Yeah, she's freaking out because she's never seen you naked. And she's afraid it looks all funky. So show no, don't don't say that part. That's not what she said. She's freaking hey, what are you doing? I mean this. I just sent a picture of your penis. No. <gasps> oh no. You did not just do that. What do you look No! I mean, it's not his, but no. I'm so. <laughs> no! You are scared because you haven't seen your future husband's manhood. This episode is wild. Oh, it's her. How did you know where she lives? I want you to pretend to be my girlfriend so she gets very sad and then breaks off the wedding and then runs away with me. <laughs> <laughs> very convincing. <laughs> I loved Big Guy with all my heart, but I have no interest in helping the guy who's standing in front of me now. Ooh. I hate your hair. <laughs> Random low blow. Prize hog shivering. Oh. Yeah, good. I'm yeah. so sorry they made you do it. I'm a dead dad. No. I'm a dead dad. No. The dead dad. What's going pass. on here? Showing you my software. No, no, no. no. Oh, oh gosh. No, 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 no. Actually, pronounced shivering. I don't know how to pronounce your name. <laughs> you were just so pretty, I didn't want to correct you. But look, the You're most so important <laughs> thing... <laughs> As they're getting married. My best. I just wanted to say that if I was ever selfish in our relationship... What do you mean if? And what do you mean relationship? <laughs> That's fair. Thanks, Schmidt. Schmitty out. Where you going, Schmidt? You live here. Why'd you come back, Schmidt? The big guy is... Well, still somewhere inside this... Perfect body. <laughs> you need your Eat the pizza. Eat all the pizza while I watch mm -hmm. right now. Mm hmm. Three whole pizzas. Oh, so can greasy. He, can you come inside? So, many, so good. <laughs> all right. Well, that was New Girl season two, episode 22. That episode was wild. All sorts of crazy stuff was happening. Like Winston in kidnapping mode. What in the world? And then. Nick and Winston trying to get a picture of the penis. <laughs> like, what? I can't. And like the entirety of the bachelorette party, just a total disaster. And then like Schmidt's mission to find a girlfriend was just insane. Like, oh my word, this whole episode was just all over the place. Um, uh, but. I did mention uh, that I was really trying hard not to go off on a rant there at the beginning. But now's the time. But I'll, I'll, I'll keep it brief. Because I seriously have very strong opinions. Um, and I get super irritated about how normalized it is for, like, everyone to have at least one sexual partner before they get married or commit to somebody. And if you don't, then you're a freak. And like, I don't think we should be pointing fingers either way. Like, just let people do what they're gonna do. And because like, I hate that when someone makes a choice about what they're gonna do in the relationship, <clears throat> like if they're going to stay a virgin, if they're going to have multiple partners, if they're going to get an arranged marriage, if they're never going to get married, like whatever they're going to do. Like other people just feel the need to like shame them and like tell them they're weird or say they're doing it wrong or whatever it is. I, it's like why? Why don't you just mind your own business and do it your way and leave me alone? It's just like, it bothers me so much. This is the problem with the world. People just don't mind their own business. <laughs> and honestly, I have um, opinions about arranged marriages too that are like, they kind of go against how pop culture often portrays them. But we will save that for another time because I've kind of got on, on a tangent a little bit 
here. So anyway, about the show itself in this episode, um, I was wondering if, uh, what was her name? Um, Katie? No, no. Uh, Elizabeth, right? Elizabeth Schitt's girl, if she was going to come back because, um, it seemed like her appearance seemed way too specific. Like, um, she wasn't just going to be like a one minute little cameo, like the other girls in his little flashbacks. Um, so like, yeah, she did, she did. She popped up at the end again. Um, and I have a feeling she's going to make another appearance, at least one more. Um, I liked her. She dropped some hard truth bombs on him that he needed to hear. Uh, and like, even whether they get together or stay together or not, um, I think like it, just even that encounter will be good for him in his little character development and everything. Um, and even if they do get together or stay together, but like, I don't think they will stay together if they do. Um, like, like I said, it'll be good, um, to move him forward and progress. Um, I was absolutely dying at everything that had to do with Nick and Winston and Chevron, apparently. <clears throat> All of that, every single thing was my favorite. Absolutely killed me. It's so funny. Um, so overall, I'd say it was a pretty funny and very chaotic episode and I enjoyed it. So I guess, uh, thank you for watching with me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And the full link will be on Patreon if you want to get out. The link is down below and I will see you next time on KREX.